Get out, you be tased! Get out! Put your hands behind your back right now! Do not move or you're gonna get yourself all kinds of hurt, okay? But you tased me, man! Well, I did tell you I was gonna tase you, right? So I called my uncle. Where my uncle at? Where, where my uncle at? Free as me. He's a detective, man. That's not, that's not what we're talking about here right now. Call my right around here, man. Get in. Get back, get back, get Watch back. Watch out. Stay, 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 stay. Let me see your hands. Let me see your hands. He's, he's getting turned. Turn over. Turn over before you get another one. It's a carjacking vehicle. Came out about 1800 this afternoon. They beat the guy up and took his vehicle from him. I just saw some people standing on the corner back at the local gas station here. It looked like they were going to fight. I'm going to circle back around and see if I can figure out what's going on. What's up, man? Have a seat for me, guys. Have a seat for me. Hey, have a seat. Get on the ground. Get on the ground. Let go of my gun. Yes, sir. You all right, man? I'm all right, man. You all right? Let me ask you something, man. Yes, what, sir. What were you running for? Because I know how you guys are. I mean, I know that I'm out here. Uh -huh. I was born and raised in East LA. I, okay. I know how you guys are gonna look at me. Man, it has nothing to do with what you look come like. Come on, man. You come out here, man. You know, it looked like you were gonna is. fight that other gentleman, sir. Yeah. That's why he stopped. Waiting right now for a delivery of another two ounces of cocaine to this household from a uh, supplier. Take the car. Take the car. Get out! Get out! Get out! Get out! I don't, I don't do that. You don't do it? You just sell it? I don't sell it. Well, you were coming here to sell it, right? Yeah. Well, that's selling it. But I didn't know it wasn't mine, though. Your castle guy was He said he saw a male black in his 30s. He was uh, kicking out, either kicking out car windows or kicking out a car. Uh, Put your hand back. Come over here, man. Come on, man. I did not come over here, man. got me. Go, go. Go, go. Go, go. Go, go. Put your hand back. Go, go. Go, go. Hand behind your back, Taser. Finger. 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 You can see his boot right, right inside of the door. The door's all caved in. I have a restraining yeah. order against yeah. him. And he was trying to entice me to come down and talk to him. That's all from him right yeah. there? Yeah. Okay. Wow. And I don't know if he's doing it here. And, and, and this isn't as bad as it could have been. I'm just yeah. glad that's not me. So can you explain the footprint on the door? I know I didn't kick the door. Okay, let me explain this. Can you explain your footprint on the door? to a disturbance call where a subject possibly intoxicated and broke into a residence threatening people with a knife. What's going on with you tonight? I'm fine. I like these guys right here. They're good guys. You just get mad. You know what I'm saying? Why they get mad at you? <laughs> Come on. I don't know, man. You gotta let me know why they get mad at you. There gotta be some kind of reason. You didn't damage that man's door? No, I didn't do nothing to this door. I mean, come on, fellas. So were you I mean, having? Were you having? I'm trying to work with you. I understand that, I'm, man. I'm, I'm, I'm handcuffed. I'm, I'm strained behind, and you guys are questioning me. But uh, the Muslims over there are, uh, you know, ready to blow up the building. Uh, he started talking about Islam because he's Muslim. Then he hit the door with the bat. I pushed him. I did push him. Push him down there. I started to feel threatened. And then he went back in the house and he grabbed the two knives and he came out. And he's like, I'm a kid. Yeah. yeah, he did. He knocked, knocked the mess out of it. Apparently, these are the knives that he approached the room with. Pretty decent size. The next time I see you guys in public, be careful yeah. what you say, man. Yeah, I'm going to love you. Both of you. There goes another charge. Are you guys seriously going to charge me? Yes, sir. I'm a goddamn Vietnam bag. God damn it. Uh, we're going to back up another officer at a uh, bar fight, an afternoon bar fight, supposedly with a hammer. And what happened here? Okay, why did we get why did we get called here about somebody having a hammer and fighting and all that kind of stuff? 
Because I was screaming. Oh, okay. Well, someone said that. Someone said that hap that you guys were fighting with a hammer back here. What was the argument about? The argument was about she's my wife. Uh huh. Uh, somebody called her phone uh, yesterday and yesterday night. I answered it. It was another guy. I got pissed off. Okay. And yeah, that's where it's at. Okay. Every single person in this bar says you were swinging a hammer. I wasn't swinging it. I had it behind my back. That was it. Number two, where is it now? In the blue truck. Okay, well, how did it end up in the blue truck? I put it in the seat after they came outside saying that I had a hammer. You drove that car up here today? Yeah, my grandma's on her way to get it. Okay, well, we need to search it because you were arrested. Why do you need to search it? Because you were the one who drove it up here. Yes, we can. You were arrested. You can't. I didn't drive it up here at all. How did it get here? It was already here. Who brought it up here? How do I know? It's not my car. It's my grandmother's car. I just told you she's coming in town to get it. She has my car. She's bringing it. Okay, very good. Be right back. Grandma's got sweet rims. This gentleman's on pretrial release for a drug arrest, which makes me believe that there's probably drugs somewhere in this car that he brought up here as well, too. Oh, drugs. I'm telling you. You're putting it on your grandma? This is no, your grandma's drugs in that life. car? Never. Then whose who's drugs are in that car? I'm t I just told you, my sister drives the car more than anybody mm -hmm. ever. So, this is hers. Please don't be drugs in this car, too. Oh, my goodness, there's drugs in this car. Oh, there's meth pipes in both vehicles. There should there's, not, can I say okay, There should not be, but there is, no, okay? Until, and then there's methamphetamine. There's a big bag of methamphetamine. Okay. That a probable cause for assault. Suspect apparently knocked out the guy he was arguing with. So right now we're using the canine to track the suspect because he fled on foot. It's just going nuts. He was very interested here. This is the police. We have a police dog. Anybody inside this trailer needs to come out or you're going to get bit. Last chance. Come out or you're going to get bit. Lose your hands! Put your hands! Get on the ground! Get on the ground! Get on the ground! When we tell you to come out, you need to come out, man. Trying to, but the dog was biting me. So, when so he, basically, so all it was was self-defense. I didn't do anything wrong. Yeah. So when he shoulder, when he shoulder bumped you, where did he hit you? When he shoulder bumped you? It was on my neck and much of my face area, right here. Your left side or right side? Okay. Sorry, I'm no. sorry. Okay. Okay. And after he, after he did that, that's when you hit him. You knocked him out. I hit him back. Knocking him unconscious from what? It's called self-defense. Okay, so why'd you run? I don't know. But you breaking into this trailer is actually burglary, right? All right, but I didn't break in though. You entered a you entered a you entered a dwelling that's not yours though. Okay. Just uh, paraphernalia, a couple of pipes they use for drugs, probably meth, crack, whatever the drug of their choice is. Hey, Calvin, why did you come out? Who was going to come back out for? Why would I come back out for? Come out, or you're gonna get bit. Good job, boy. Good job, good boy. I'm going to count for it. I'm going to count for it.